Taste its taste and welcome to Popsicorn's Friendship Bazaar. This is chapter one, so I'm assuming there's going to be other chapters released in the future. I'm not sure if this is a My Little Pony horror game, but if it is, I have Rainbow Dash here to help me through it. Hello there, over here. Why don't you come closer to the lighted zone so we can speak better, dearie? Okay. Hi, much better. Now I have a better glimpse of that cute little face of yours. Hmm, you look a little bit clueless of where you are or how you got here on the first place. But fear not, dearie. It's a very common symptom that everyone gets at the beginning. Oh, but where are my manners? Let me introduce myself properly. I'm Popsicorn the Unicorn, and this is my bazaar. This is a place where you can buy and sell rare items of sorts. Huh? What's the matter? You don't have a single coin to spend, nor anything to sell? Quite a predicament. If you want to stay, dear, you need to buy some of my wares. And for that purpose, you need some gold coins that you can expend. You know, shiny round pieces of gold that make the world beautiful? So why don't you go outside and try to find some coins while I wait for your return? Now be on your way, ta-ta! She doesn't really care about me! She just wants me as a customer. Oh, I feel so used. Whoa, a nice little area. This music's kind of freaking me out. Can I pick this stuff up? This box looks different. Can I pick it up or something? No, can't move it, can't do anything. I can't break anything? Where are these coins? I guess we gotta keep walking through the woods. Oh, there's something over there. There's something there. Okay, there's a gate over there. What's over here? It's a fence. I get through this? Maybe I can get through this wire if I have something to cut through. Today I had to repair the hole that Mean Pegasus made yesterday to my poor little main wall. I used some wire mesh which may not be as strong as my precious wall, but I hope that's strong enough to keep intruders out while I get the time to fully repair that horrible hole. Now that I think about it, I couldn't find anywhere my friendly clippers, which I used to cut Mr. Wiry Mesh. Probably I forgot them behind the east gate. However, I'll take care of that later, as they are about to arrive any moment now. Oh, there's a nice treasure chest back there. Okay, it's locked. The key should be nearby. This has to be where the clippers are going to be. I can knock down this wall if I hit it with something heavy enough. Heavy enough. Okay, over here there's barrels and things. Okay, let me see if this box does anything. Didn't work. Try it again. Try it again. Get over there. That's not heavy enough. Okay. Come with me, milk jug. <laughs> see if you're heavy enough. All right. Let me see if the milk jug works. Ah, it did. Perfect. That's what we needed. Out of the way, milk jug. I gotta get in there. Get, 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 get. Give me any more trouble and I'll sick rainbow dash on you. That's right. We're looking for clippers, more milk jugs, more stuff. Oh, I see something behind there. It has been only three days and I have made some friends. I was welcomed with some nice presents from all my neighbors. They were all nice and friendly. I mean, I couldn't expect less from a place called Friendship Meadows, right? What else can I ask for? Maybe a shivering ice cream? But that would be on some other occasion. Anyway, I just wanted to add that I really like this place so much. It's town folks and all the nature that surrounds us. It's like a dream come true, and I'm really starting to feel at home right now. Well, that was a nice letter, and so far this game is nothing what I expected. I thought it was going to be scarier. What do we got over here? Ooh, it's a candles or something? Candles? Aha, there you go. The clippers. I see you, fence. Your days are numbered. I've got the clippers. They should cut right through this. I see some lights up ahead. Past the trees. What's going to be over here? Probably the key to get in the other area to look what's inside that chest. What do we got? Yep, it's the key. Perfect. Key in hand. I'm making my way now to where I need to use it. There's a padlock just over here. To my left, I believe. Yes, right here. And there's the chest. Ooh, what's inside? Bing, 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 bing. Is this going to be something good or bad? <gasps> ah! Uh-oh. What happened? Cool coin. Holy jumpers! Okay, this is where it gets scary! Look at the size of his hand! That is freaky looking! 
As long as this thing doesn't get faster or something, I should be okay. Let's just keep collecting coins and keep away from that thing. What's this say? 50! I gotta collect 50! I got 13! Oh my goodness, I got a long ways to go. I think it's getting faster! With more coins I collect, it's getting faster! Oh no! That's bad! I can run, right? Yeah, I can run. Okay, that's my stamina bar there. Okay, if I stop, what happens? Okay, he goes back down. I found the snow while running around. It has been a couple days, and all I can do is think about the mysterious jewel. Was it a dream, or was it reality? I mean, I know I was sleeping on my bed, but it felt real. Way too real for just a dream. If what the angel said was true, there has to be a way to open a doorway leading to the tower. I have tried with all the spells that I know, even with the ones from the books in the shop, but with no success at all. Just the thought of living without that jewel is driving me crazy. I... I have to think about something else if I want to see it again. I think if I get too far away from it, it disappears and it reappears. Look at that. Comes out of the ground, stands up on its hind legs, and then starts running at me! Jeez! Stop taking all my gold coins! Why is it that when things start to chase me, I freak out and now I can't find any gold coins? I only have 28. I gotta get to 50. And that thing is definitely getting faster with every coin. Here it comes. <laughs> oh no! Coin! Gimme, gimme, gimme! That thing is grease lightning now! Oh my god! I got it, dear diary! Finally, I got it! While I was experimenting with other kind of magic in the back store, I accidentally disintegrated one of the walls, revealing a secret room filled with rare magical items and books. It was a secret room from the previous shopkeeper. Lucky me! While inspecting some of the books, I found a ritual powerful enough to open a doorway to another world. The downside is that in order for it to work, there's something that has to be offered. Friendship elements. It makes sense as friendship is the most powerful kind of magic known, and friendship elements reside in the special things that ponies love and care. Each one is unique and very specific to every one of us. Fortunately, I know some friends with a lot of friendship elements, but something awful is that maybe some of the friendship elements may be a little bit alive, but I don't think that anyone notices a little mouse disappeared, right? In any case, I'm going to need a larger space to perform the ritual. Maybe the space inside that old barn in the middle of the woods will be enough. Three more left to get. I'm turning on every lamp I see. That thing seems to use them as teleporters or something. Yes, the last one's here. Ooh, he's right behind me. I'm not sure if I can outrun him. Turn the light on. He's right behind me. Gotta watch my stamina. I gotta make him teleport out of here. There. There he's gone. He's gone. Okay. He's away. We're good. Oh, I found another coin! 55 coins! Another one! 56! 56 coins! Sweet! All I need is 50 to get out of here! <gasps> yes! Oh, 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 oh. Can you come in here? Ah, you can! Ah, well, maybe you can! Crap, I can! Go! Run! I was too confident! Oh my god! Oh no! Look at the tree! Oh my god, it's right behind me! I mean, watch it, watch it, watch it, watch it, watch it. Oh, no, it got me just before the doors. All right, I'm back. I get one more. There it is. This time I'm not fooling around. This is where I need to go. He's not around. Perfect. Yes, go. He's going to be there. Yep, he's going to be there. This time I know he chases me. Yep, here he comes. We're fine. Just relax. <sighs> Is he coming? Oh, he's not coming. He stops. Does he stop? No, he doesn't stop! This time we're getting in. Bye-bye, sucker. Here he comes. Chase! No, don't go in there! <gasps> Too bad I made it this time. Whoa, what happened? Everything just changed. It's bigger now. Uh-oh. <gasps> it's in a different spot. What is, what is going on? She's still here. I don't trust her. Wonderful! You have returned with some gold coins? Now that you are here with some currency, you could buy some of my wares! You look scared and confused, and it seems that you have been through a lot of pressure recently. Poor little thing. I'm really sorry for you. She's gonna eat me or something. But don't worry, you don't have to be afraid anymore because you are safe and sound with me. When someone says that, it means you aren't. Alrighty then, why don't you take a look at my stuff and buy something meanwhile to kill some time. Notice kills in capital. Uh-oh. Give me the knife. 
It's bloody, I don't care. Give me the knife. That's like the knife and pinky parties. Cookies. Oh, peanut butter. I can't have cookies. Milk, no milk. Nothing caught your attention? Too bad. I guess that my things aren't for everyone. You wouldn't let me buy anything. What's that? You want to leave, but the front door is sealed. I'm locked in here with this thing. My, my. Don't be sad, dearie. I knew it. She's evil. Here, take this as a gift of our friendship. What's the key? This key is probably bad news, but I have to take it. Maybe there's something upstairs that may help you with your little problem. Yeah, my little problem of life? There's death up here. The whole shop. It's different. It's bigger. I got teleported here when I entered from the doors. <gasps> I unlocked it. You had this key all along. Oh, it's dark. Oh, no. That lantern just comes on automatically. What's that? Oh, it's a big sledgehammer. Oh, I got that. Ah! Skulls. Oh, no! It's the chapter end! Wow, that was pretty good. It started off all nice and friendly, then turned creepy as that thing was chasing me around the forest, and I'm really not trusting Popsicorn at the moment, but maybe we'll find out more about her in the next chapter if that ever gets released. All right, everyone, that was Popsicorn's Friendship Bazaar. I hope you enjoyed my playthrough of it. If you did, please take a moment and give the video a like. And if you haven't yet, consider joining the Taste Bud family for daily gameplay content. Love you guys, love you Molly. See you all next time. And thanks to you Rainbow Dash for giving me the courage to get through this game.